Alright, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to episode 60 of Hermit Pack. Uh, <laughs> as some of you guys will will uh, will notice, I'm actually not on the Hermitcraft mod pack at the moment. That's right, I, I'm on a pack with Bimes of Plenty and stuff. This here is Foolcraft. This is a mod pack and a mod server that I launched, although I'm in a single player world at the moment, uh, uh, of a world that I launched, uh, a mod pack that I launched yesterday on my channel. Which, uh, in case you haven't seen it already, uh, uh, and you're a Hermit Pack fan, you should totally go check out. I, I play with uh, many of the people that played on here, and also some new people. Uh, anyway, this video today is one of the hardest and saddest videos that, that you can ever do uh, uh, as a YouTuber. Well, I mean... It's not that bad, but <laughs> I rarely do these videos. I, I just usually I, I leave a series whenever I'm done with it and when I feel done and when I'm not enjoying it as much anymore. I, I just leave it and, and you guys keep asking, etc. But this time I decided because I wasn't really uh, burnt out on Hermit Pack, I didn't, I didn't feel that the pack was boring. I didn't feel that it was done necessarily. Uh, I, I personally, I'd, I had plans to continue Hermit Pack for a little while longer, for quite, quite a while longer. I've said in the past that I wanted to do a hundred episodes, um, but we came to, uh, uh, we came, we, we took a decision as a group. Uh, a couple of weeks ago, or a week ago or so, uh, because not so many Hermits were playing on there anymore, and because a lot of people joined Hermit Pack and played only for a few weeks or, or for a month, uh, we decided that the people that were still playing that uh, will end Hermit Pack. And uh, all of us who were still playing on the server uh, uh, also joined in uh, on Foolcraft, so it didn't make sense to have two big mod pack series running. And I agree with that, I agree with that. But I want to say... Uh, this is this has been a hard decision for me because I have really enjoyed Hermit Pack and more importantly, the support, the love from you guys have been over the roof. This has been one uh, one of my most successful series ever, and uh, yeah, I've spent I've, I think I've, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna set this in stone, but I'm pretty sure that I've spent most time of any any other hermits on this uh, uh, on Hermit Pack and. Uh, I spent endless nights just having fun playing the pack, and uh, it's been a great time. Uh, Foolcraft, however, that, that will replace Hermit Pack, I think will be even better, because uh, we, we got some more, uh, we got more plans for the beginning of community uh, projects playing together and stuff, and we got a pack that uh, supports the whole multiplayer and long-term Minecraft a little bit better than Hermit Pack uh, did. Now, you gotta remember, we released Hermit Pack very, very early of modded 1.10, and, and sometimes uh, when you do that, uh, world generation and stuff like that uh, doesn't quite work out, and you kind of, you throw all the mods in there, and you don't really have a direction, and, and you kind of, you, you play, you play around and see what works. Now, Foolcraft is a very polished mod pack, <laughs> as opposed to Hermit Pack, and uh, if you guys enjoyed Hermit Pack, I encourage you, go and check out Foolcraft, make sure you follow the series, like I said, the, the active Hermits, the people that were playing on, uh, on this server, when it it, when it ended today, uh, uh, all are on Foolcraft, so it it makes sense if you want to continue to follow this type of Minecraft. Anyway, what we did earlier, so uh, last week when I was mid in the middle of my flu, uh, Exuma forced me to to do a uh, to do a group recording together with Exuma and and Rendog and Falls. And we did a little bit of a base tour. Now we also toured my base, my beautiful factory, which I gotta say, with you guys that. It's been one of my best builds so far. Hashtag Factory of Doom down below in the comments if you enjoyed the factory. Uh, uh, and uh, yeah, we, we toured that as well. But I decided to cut that out of this video because you guys have seen my base so many times. And if you want to see the tour of it, then you, you go check it out on, on Fall Symmetry's channel or on Ren's channel or on uh, Isuma's channel. And you'll see the tour that we did. I, I pulled some funny jokes. I tried to laugh with 40 degrees fever. That That's 40 degrees Celsius, not 500. That's like 500,000 Fahrenheit. Whatever, weirdos. <laughs> but yeah, anyway, guys, I, it's really weird for me to do this video. I just want to say, again, massive thank you for, for the support uh, of Hermipack. Please don't go and just super hate on this video just to be jerks. <laughs> I've been working hard on Foolcraft uh, to have a replacement for Hermipack to make sure that uh, those of you who, who really enjoyed this series uh, can get invested in a new similar series with, with a bit of a twist. Look at the landscape of Foolcraft. 
This is good. This is gorgeous. And uh, yeah, I got some plans for Foolcraft. There will be an episode back to back already tomorrow. Uh, episode two tomorrow that I've already recorded. So yeah, uh, stay stay tuned for that. Anyway, with all, without further ado, I've been talking for like five minutes already. Uh, guys, again. I bow and thank you so much for uh, for for everything that you've done uh, for all your support and love in Hermit Pack. Uh, I'm gonna roll the footage now, and and that will be the end of it. If you want to download the Hermit Pack world, go to hermitcraft.com. There is a download link for the world in case you want to play around with it. Also, we updated Hermit Pack the other day to fix the uh, some some major major bug fixes that was in the pack. So there is a final release of Hermit Pack on the FTB launcher or on the Curse launcher. Anyway. Take a look at this base tour. Uh, just, just a little bit of a, uh, of a, of a quick heads up. Make sure you watch it through because uh, f false base and what she has done towards the end of this video blew me away. Excuse me, you fools. What? Hi. You calling what? me a fool? What are you doing here? We're invading. <laughs> this base is ours now, right? <laughs> Watch out, Ren. Oh, ouch. oh, he's gonna oh. die from that. He has no armor. Crazy <laughs> idiot. <laughs> I love that sound. <laughs> Down in the water. Freaking idiot. <laughs> Hi, guys. What's going on? Uh, we're here base. for a tour. Oh, are you? Yeah, mm -hmm. tour your base, man. <laughs> nice hat. Bro. Thanks. I, I made it like myself. It's similar to Iskow's, but mine is better. Does it, does it like, solo charge your brain? I think it does, man. It gives Wait a minute, my brain it, it's like the exact same as mine, but you have a different color. Uh, yeah. I can't actually see it myself. No, no, you have to look oh, in I the inventory. Oh, I can if I press <laughs> e. Yeah, mine's mine's green. Yours is orange. Yep. Actually, I prefer oh, orange. Do you want to swap? <laughs> no, screw that, man. Screw that. Oh. Hey, oh. listen, you two. The... Hi. Hi. That's better. Welcome to the Ren base. The reason that we're here, though. Is a little bit sad, isn't it? I mean, usually, usually it takes something to get all of the hermits together. We're the last remaining hermit packers, aren't we? Sad music. <laughs> What's going on? Um, <laughs> but anyway, yes, we have come together. We are gathered here today. Because Ren will die. Uh... <laughs> 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 oh, and I spawned all the way back at the middle. You, oh, oh, you oh idiot! No. <laughs> you tell me you haven't okay. set your spawn in your base. <laughs> How long have you been playing on this server for, man? <laughs> it's yep. been like eight months. Jeez, man, nine months. Yeah, that, no, eight true. months. Okay, well, I tell you what, I, it's you. Go on, Disco. What are we doing here, man? I'm confused. No, I was hearing. I was hearing you talking like we are gathered here today to witness the death of Ren Dog, who died what like a noob whilst fighting a crispy Iskal. I thought that was what you were gonna say, wasn't it? It was. Yeah. S sounded like it. What happened to your face? Yeah, it's a. a I I grew a I grew a tash and a nose. Did you make that with chisel and bits? No. 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 Have you not seen them yet? I have no, not seen that yet, oh. but it made me think. With this, uh, with this block helmet thing, where you can put a block on it, you could you could chisel in bits of face. No, maybe that's a bad idea. Um, <laughs> careful, everybody! There's about to be a oh, huge. Okay, oh, stand back. Yeah, Hang on, no, I'm gonna pick it all up. I'm gonna pick it all up, Bren. Uh, <laughs> Why do you have carrots in your inventory, dude? Oh <laughs> There'd be oh. carrots in oh. your inventory. <laughs> Free items. No. Ren, okay. oh, dude. Who is this? Who is this guy in here? Ren, um, come in this yeah, house. Goodness. Oh hi! Hold on, I just need my wings. Okay, there, I've got my. It's... Look, I have so much stuff. Like, I'm getting away from guys. it. It's freaking me out. But Ren, uh, this this guy is um, <clears throat> he's he's been here since the beginning of my of my series. He's great. He's he's dead. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Oh, I hate villagers. Why? I've been wanting to do that for ages. Oh, you're oh, such an man. idiot. <laughs> All right. Um, anyway, so people, it's coming to an end, unfortunately. So what we thought we would do, we'd come together, we'd show off our bases to each other a little bit, and uh, and we'd you know we'd we'd go away on a on a good note, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. On a C major. Yeah. 
Give us the grand tour, man. What's going on here? What is this place? Okay, well, welcome to the Ren base, which is just a giant, I don't even know, conglomerate of nonsense right now. Um, <laughs> it's supposed to be a giant city in the in the desert. It's got a couple of cool things. This little contraption over here you see, very useful. Uh, hold on. If I stick some rotten flesh in this storage crate, Ooh. it it makes Ooh. liquid blood. Uh, ah, that's how you got blood. the blood. Liquid blood. Oh no! Yeah. What? That's it how it you makes... got the blood. Rent's a vampire. Vampire. It makes loads of buckets <laughs> of blood, which is which is cool. Um, uh, it's huh. kind of pointless, but um, you know, it's it, it, <laughs> you know. Yeah, so, yeah. yeah. I re I recognize this garbage. <laughs> yeah, so, loads yeah. of blood, which is good. <laughs> um, if you come over here, I've got like a really beautiful p uh, plastic factory, which I'm very proud of. Uh, probably my best factory build in the series makes plastic. Um, yeah, cool. that's <laughs> very yeah. beautiful, he says. Because uh, why not? <laughs> yeah, I like all the piping. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> now, I guess uh, this is just the sort of facade of my base. The majority of my base is downstairs. If you lot will follow me this way, I'll take okay. you down. There's into... a really strange smell coming from this pipe. Oh yeah, it, it's disgusting oh. escalium juice that's being pumped Ugh. here. Area 85. It'll become clear why in a moment. Uh, <laughs> come it's come a, it's down old, here. Old base. Now, my, enti my entire base is basically <coughs> chisel and bits. I decided to try and use chisel and bits a lot for the series because I love the mod. So everything you see is basically um, is chisel and bits, which is sweet. And it turned out pretty good. Um, trying to make like a laboratory type thing. It's uh, a gorgeous I wanna, I wanna base, I gotta say. Brain. I want to mention yeah. something. Uh, yeah. Every time, like, I use chisel and bits, I get these comments about lag, lag, and the author of chisel and bits themselves said yeah. they designed this in the best way possible so that it would not cause lag. Look at your base, man. Every single block oh, of chisel spider. and bits, and Run. there is no <laughs> FPS issues here at all, man. Just wanted to. Yeah, yeah. Like absolutely. Uh -huh. I mean, it, there's, th there's tens of thousands of chisel and bits blocks, and there's no lag at all. But yeah, this is the power Ooh. system. I make uh, barbecue pulled pork burgers and cook them in culinary generator Ooh. three. Wait a minute. Actually, you make actually barbecue. Actually, Iskal makes the burgers. Yeah, I make me. the burgers. <laughs> I make the burgers. So um, I, I process the meat and the ingredients, send them over to Iskal, and he makes barbecue pulled pork burgers for me. Then he sends them back via that pipe you saw, and then I make <laughs> them, put them into power. The most inefficient power generation in modern history. But there you go. Ren, um, why are there... If you guys come this way. Why are there a crap ton of <laughs> spiders, spiders everywhere? Yeah. <laughs> oh, I, I wonder, Iskull. I wonder. <laughs> uh, they, they were invisible cave spider spawners that Iskull put all over my base. Thanks, my buddy. <laughs> you know, so <laughs> Correct. Yeah. That's a bit high. <laughs> uh, this over here is the Iskallium generator. And uh, basically what this does is it turns Iskallium into squid. Um, and yeah, basically all that Iskallium you saw coming out of the pipe is being turned into squidage. In here it's actually not on at the moment so you can't see the squidage but um yeah oh. uh, <clears throat> uh, hold on just give me oh geez the lag oh I... <laughs> okay there we go uh, we should start seeing some squidage now going through the reactor <laughs> um but yeah that's basically as far as i got my plan was to make like a really massive cool looking city up upstairs with roads and stuff but um uh, we're gonna have to wait for the next modern series i guess right <laughs> i guess so mm -hmm. yeah I, I love it though. I love it though. This base is this base is gorgeous. It is amazing. Um, it's pretty cool. There's a project in the very middle of the uh, the base buddies world that never got finished, right? Yeah. 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 It's kind of the shame of the desert. It's been it's been <laughs> defiled with graffiti. I feel I feel really bad because I so wanted to like get on and finish this at some point, and then ah, uh, it just never got round to Look it. Look at the graffiti realize, though. Oh. X equals nerd. Looks like yeah. like a, a a ruin. This is why it never got finished, this gal, because it's you. <laughs> you start building it, and then these little kids come along and start graffitiing all over it. You troublemaker. It's just nerd yeah, everywhere. I love it. <laughs> oh. Also, there's a Santa over here, but but um, <coughs> I'm not sure who this was supposed to be for, but- I thought well, this was your I... base, Ren. <laughs> oh, oh, I my know. base. Oh, you finally found your Santa, Ren. I finally found my Santa. I was so upset with Falsy for not giving me a Christmas present. She gave everybody else a Christmas <laughs> present except me, but- Well, he's what? dead a little bit. And all you got was coal. Oh. Who, d who ripped up my Santa? <laughs> <laughs> you Poor freaking Santa. Swedish freak. <laughs> Why?
Oh. Look, he's Do you know there's something like, really cool bits, here, by the way? He's just floating. Just, yeah. He's in bits and pieces right now. He's jeez. Oh, I love the shuriken well, right in his half body there. That is awesome. <laughs> <You're seven laughs> this is half. awful. This is awful. Yeah. Oh, right. You've upset Ren. Oh, look! Oh, look! Oh, look at him! <laughs> oh, oh, look! No. <laughs> oh, poor Ren. I'm glad we're never playing on the server again. I hate you, as <laughs> <laughs> have, have you guys ever seen my uh, my super elevator of doom? Yeah, I have. I've used it. Yep. The the little stair thing. Yeah, That's I great. was thinking. I was thinking. Uh, I was thinking vanilla, right? But this is so cool, man! Look how fast you can zip upwards on it. It is pretty crazy. I remember it's you being really super fun, proud right? of it as well. Oh man, I was so happy because it, it just whiz up it, man! It's so good. So I want to show you guys uh, what is probably one of my favourite things I built, and I kind of built it sort of by accident, right? This thing here will teleport mobs to it. There's a block in there from Ender.io. So it's a mob farm, right? Uh, but what's really cool about it is it means you don't have to light up your area or do anything fancy. Because it just teleports the mobs that spawn in this area inside of it. And then oh, you don't cool. have to light up caves or anything like that. Yeah, it's yeah. a super OP block because there's going to be mobs near you anyway. Yeah. Um, so that, that as a starter farm would have been really great. But basically they drop down there onto the diamonds and they die. And see you later, mobs, you know? <laughs> That's cool. I like um, it. I like it. Yeah. How big so of an area theme... does it work in? Oh, it's quite big. It's like, I think it's like 100 blocks in each direction or something. So it gets wow. slimes from up the top. It gets them all out of the caves. And yeah, it's a pretty, pretty powerful thing. Um, but the theme of my base is basically a desert theme. And I had to sort of figure my way out through it. And that means building with like flat roofs. And so there's lots of these little buildings around. This one right here is a factory for potion brewing. I, I, like, uh, the, another... I like the walls design. <clears throat> mm -hmm. <clears throat> yeah. Why is why is it that you like that, Iskal? <laughs> Does it remind you of something? They look they look similar to, to yeah yeah I, I remember this I remember me and Exuma sitting here one evening playing. It's like yeah, dude, how how would one build factory walls? I'm like I I have a factory. <laughs> yeah, man. Oh, classic. I appreciate it, man. You gave me the inspiration I needed to make. It looks it great so. here. I really like the the color of the green and the sandstone. I really like yeah, the. Yeah, I contrast. love the chisel and bits too. Like really good chisel and bits work there. Oh, thank you. Like, I'm, I'm like glad you like it. Because yeah, honestly, I really struggled gorgeous. with these materials. Right. I, I decided I'm going to challenge myself. I'm going to use yellow, green, and brown. And then I found it quite difficult. But if you you know you put in the time, you come up with something that looks all right. So yeah, this is one of name. my many unfinished projects where I just run into problems in modded, right? Like <laughs> things just get too complicated yeah. for me. And then I'm like, oh, I don't know what to do. And I move on. Um, so over in this area, you shall see that there are lots and lots of little buildings and all of them go to different dimensions. Because my idea for this season was that I would put all of my projects in different dimensions. So there's like mm -hmm. over here, you can go to different dimensions that have ores inside of them for mining. Ooh. Um, there is like a wither dimension. I can't even remember. I made so many dimensions, you know, you can you can <laughs> teleport to the ends, to mob farms, yep. to places where there's power. The one place that's probably worth checking out would be this one, right? So can you guess where this place is going to take you to? There are some subtle hints. Um, <laughs> wither, wither dimension. Obsidii. Obsidii? Um, no, yeah, wither, wither killing we'll dimension. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, that's the one. I've never seen okay. this actually. Get in but the queue. I, I did. I did. Uh, I did put up with the noise for a, quite a while. <laughs> oh yeah. <It's, laughs> you don't have enough power, bit... X. You don't have it's enough bit... power. Oh, is there really not? I, I do not know why there would be. Not He's done it. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, there we go. We need a t so, need a time to re no, It's a tiny bit janky here because I've uh, I've gone and like tweaked and adjusted things and then like left a few blocks missing. But you can get the general theme of the area. There's uh, a wither skeleton farm here, and for the life of me, I can't remember how I turned this thing on. <laughs> <laughs> I can't remember nice. the controls for any of the stuff here. So, yeah, there'll be wither skeletons for wither skeleton skulls. Uh, in this area, you would have your uh, your withers being spawned. They get, they get stuck in those cages, which uses a very vanilla technique. Uh, you can kind of just look at it and figure it out, right? Like, there's soul sand placing, there's wither skull placing... Yeah, uh, around this area, it makes the and then, skulls, mm -hmm. and then there's like a block missing up here again. It would be nice <laughs> and dark in there. Um, and then over on this side, there is a soul sand farm, uh, which probably makes it in the most awkward and difficult ways there is. But 
Yeah. <laughs> if we go outside, we can we can see what it looks like. Nothing nothing special from out Jeez. here, right? The sky is so blue. <laughs> yeah, it's part of the dimension, man. The dimensions can have different you've sizes. Done, you've done a sky block, a, a sky block uh, uh, world. <laughs> yeah, yeah, pretty much. I mean, that's what you can do in this mod pack. You can just make a dimension and like start a sky factory site base. Yeah, so, yeah I, I like it. I like this place. This is very clever. Well there's done. A, there's a sand generator here as well, but that's not of much interest. Uh, to get out of here, we want to go stand on the teleporter. I believe the other one over there takes you somewhere else altogether. Oh, jeez. Okay. This thing is taking its time. <laughs> yep. It's getting backed up, man. There's too many people passing through it. Yep. <laughs> so welcome to the, uh, to the main ziggurat. This is the inside of uh, my base area. We're waiting for you now, Ren. Yeah. Is everything all right over there? <laughs> I'm, I'm stuck on the other side. There we go. Wait for me, there guys. we go. We're okay. coming back. Okay. Hi, Ren. Hi. <laughs> so, um, hmm, what can I say? This is like my central area, and I Your never fart really zone. Adding... The fart zone. Yeah. Okay. This is the fart <laughs> zone, as this girl call it. I never really finished like adding loads of little machines and stuff, but this is like the terminal. I've got my refined storage system. And like access to other machines. Uh, what's glitchy blocks? Yeah, yeah they look glitchy blocks. in in uh, in Optifine. Ah, uh, uh, okay. I, I use fast FPS. So anyway, uh, okay. guys, come come back come back down here. You wanna you wanna follow okay. me around the back here? Cause yeah. there's more down below. Hi. I never go. knew how to get down here. I always broke the floor. <laughs> 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 really? This is the Crazy. easiest yeah. way. <laughs> Jeez. So I was watching a certain someone's videos and they were using a mod that had this immersive engineering wiring in and I really yeah. wanted to use that so I decided to build a factory themed area below <laughs> and this just stores auto crafting and items and then over here there's like this corridor for uh, all of this storage using drawers so there's like tons and tons of items here being stored. <laughs> um, I love the cabling, it looks so cool. It yeah. does, doesn't yeah, it? I, I really I like that it. immersive engineering mod. I feel like you can, yeah. you can. Well, Iskal showed us that you can use it as like a, a core theme of your base because the, the style of it lends itself to like a particular theme. You know, mm -hmm. a factory. Uh -huh. theme. I love the rustiness down here, man. Like you really do have like a, a real good like theme happening. You know, yeah. like yeah. rust, yeah. rust. It feels factory. very moist and stuff down here. This is gorgeous. Yeah, it's great. I, to me, it looks kind of dry, but I guess you could easily throw some water in it. It'll give you that feel. What with the rust. Oh, creep it. <laughs> yeah. Don't, don't worry about this stuff. This is all like unfinished room back here. Oh, why is there now greenery in my base? I, I have no idea that oh. there's a scallium oh. here. Oh, I think I know why. <laughs> oh, jeez, the leg. Oh, no. That was blood everywhere. Real. All this blood everywhere. <laughs> what it's are you really, doing, Get that up. <laughs> I'm trying to get rid of it, but it won't go away. There we go. Oh. If, we, oh. uh, if we fly back outside... Yeah. Um, there's just a few more buildings really to point out. There's also like some of these paths that are interesting. Um, hey, this side over here. Hello. So these chisel and bits paths, right? I thought this would be a really great idea to have paths going around your base like this. Problem mm -hmm. is a small stretch like this would take like an hour or two. It takes them a while, it's, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's a real pain in the butt. Um, but then what we have here is like the idea was to create a little bit of story behind the base, and it was that mm -hmm. um, that the cactus fueled the civilization here, right? Because you use the cactus to make the Midori block, which is the green one, mm -hmm. and so they got Midori farms. There's two of them over the back here, and they kind of like power the base, so to speak. Um, then there's one other build I want to show you guys that's unfortunately unfinished. Check this out over here. Oh, Does it look cool? My my world is not loading in properly. Oh. How do you reload the chunkage? Control? Yeah, that happens to me too, in the chunk. F3 and A. There we <laughs> go. Okay, that's fixed it. So this is my other big factory next to the potion one, and this one processes water, so there's like a sort of semi-lush area here at the front. And I just got it started on the insides where you see that this, like, this slime, this disgusting slime juice dripping down from the slime island gets converted here into water. Ah, clever. Um, that's awesome. That I love that. Cool. Yeah. Using block... Uh, nice. But guys, I'm taking huge inspiration from you guys because I've always been a very practical player and now, yeah. I'm, now I'm trying to incorporate the ideas of theme and story into how I play. And uh, this has been like a really good learning experience because here you can see, you know, yeah. none of this stuff is necessary. Nothing's actually happening no. here, but 
it's really fun for the story of the base that you know you use what's in the area to convert it into water and it generates I love it, power man. so i mean stuff. basically like the, the purpose of this is to generate grid power but you've added instead of just making a little grid power factory like you know you've added a like yes, model to add like a story to it right <laughs> like it's yeah. beautiful, man. yeah i've seen your i've seen your room it's shameful your grid power room <laughs> yeah yeah i never I never took care of that <laughs> Oh. But you know what, X, like, this is such a great example for me of the future of modded. Like, this is what we should be doing in modded, man. We should be using modded to make really cool stuff that doesn't do anything but looks awesome. Yeah, <laughs> I, I agree. Yeah. Uh, it's a Next part. level hashtag. But I always, I always want to combine the two, you know. That's why this had to have something like the watermill underneath. It couldn't, it couldn't just be there for the looks. Like, I like to mix the two together. But you're absolutely right, man. And, it's great, man. You know, I, I could walk you around a few more things in my base that there is, like buildings, dimensions, but I think you kind of get the gist of everything. I really uh, like this. Yeah, what... uh, you, you said that you struggled with the with the block theme, but I gotta say, this is this is gorgeous, man. I think you did it well, perfectly. When, I, when yeah. I say struggle, what I'm getting at is that like none of this came easy. I just had to like spend a lot of time on it, right? <laughs> Sometimes you find a group of blocks and it just goes easily. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. but, yeah. But I appreciate yeah. the compliment. Thank you. Um, it means a lot because I spent a lot of time on this, and that's pretty much it. Then I've shown you just about uh, everything there is to see around here. I, I don't yeah. know. I still don't understand how you did the the part that overlaps here. Um, oh, I see. It's very a, a thin layer. It's it's a thin layer, isn't it? Mm -hmm. yeah. of, of, of bits. This is genius, Falsy. Oh, I love that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's so cool. By the way, your house is just wow, brilliant. <laughs> yeah, well, it's thank gorgeous. you. It's, Insane. It's actually very vanilla, though. I see any problem with it. I haven't really gone. Well, that's that, that's what's good about it. Like, I mean, building is building, right? Yeah, yeah. I try and mix in like little bits of modded. So, like, there's like a little birdhouse on the side and like a snowman and things. Oh, you know, it's like a little doorbell and things. <laughs> One time, I was Tiny stuck details. in your house for like 10 minutes. I couldn't get out. Oh, it's an hour. I don't know. I went right, down in some cool. basement and stuff. It was so weird. Oh, okay. Yeah, there's a teleport block. What's it called? One, once you shift on. Ah, okay. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, man. So what I love about your base, Morsi, is like, there's so many things to just look at. That's what I love about your base the most. <laughs> like, everywhere you look is like a little bit of chisel and bitsy to look at. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so cool. just, just little details. Um, yeah, if you come downstairs, that, that's kind of like where the modded stuff like properly starts, I guess. Yeah, this is where um, I was stuck. Uh, mm -hmm. Yes, yeah, so I've just got villagers. My plan was to use them until uh, they may have died at some point. Not saying any names. Not did... looking at someone right now. <laughs> <laughs> did, did I kill, kill the villagers? <laughs> no, they, I don't they know. might have all died at some point. <clears> yeah. <throat> yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. So there's some villages. There's like you know a little storage area. We've got like this. This is as far as I went with the grid power. This water like fountain in here. The most yeah. simple. Yeah. Well, it's better, it's as long as I could mine. fly, that was it. That's all I cared <laughs> for. <laughs> um, this and then is such yeah. Such a cool build theme. I really like block? the uh, the the oak log like with the stone. Oh, the yeah, support yeah. pillars, man. Look at those support pillars. They're sweet. Yeah, I tried to make them a bit, a bit round. They kind of work actually. Oh, jeez. This makes me so inspired to do more chisel and bits, Foss. <laughs> can, we, can we just carry on with the series, everyone? Can we just cancel <laughs> the plans? Yeah. yeah. Okay, if we want to go down, this this block right by the stairs is the one to shift on. Ooh. If you just shift once, there's two sides that are pretty much done. Where did you guys go? Awesome. I don't uh, know. I'm in a room floor, with, uh, I think. actually, yeah. really? and We shifted on. once. You shifted twice. Oh, maybe. Oh. Okay, this floor's not very interesting. Let's shift again. <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> this one. Yeah, this is the one. Oh, wow. Look at this. Whoa. Ooh. Hello. <laughs> so blood I kind of went with the blood magic thing. Yeah. Wow. Didn't didn't get very far with the mod, mod, but I went further with the, like, room design, I guess, more than anything. But it works, I think. It's really oh. cool. It, it, is this gold? This is chiseled bits, this gold lining here, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The gold, uh, like, uh, gradient block, yeah. Oh, man, that's so, so awesome. Amazing. And it's it's gradiated, too. Like, it goes from orange to yellow. Mm-hmm. That's gorgeous. Well, so you're Holy a freak, crap. Man. Yeah, How did you do this? It's so awesome. Don't you ever get out. Like, <laughs> calling me, calling me no life before. Jeez, <laughs> look at this. 
but this is as, as much as the rooms went. Like this is the most detailed room in this base. Until we get to the zoo, there isn't anything more detailed, I, I guess. Um, and then I kind of went with the spawner thing down here. Ooh, why am I not? I guess it's similar to Huh? Got why am I not surprised that you have a zoo? Are you and animals in Minecraft, man? Yeah. <laughs> you love collecting them. Um. Oh, these have changed. The textures of the uh, conveyor belts have changed, I guess. Oh, yeah, they have. They're supposed to be brown. Yeah, they look different. I can't remember what they look like, but they look well, different. Than... What mod are they from? I don't were know. They, were them. they the ones that were in Iskal Space earlier, or are they different to that? I think they're different to that one. Okay. <laughs> But yeah, um, that's pretty much for the space. We'll, I think, head to the zoo. So if we go back yes. up to teleport. <laughs> okay. And then... I think there's more the down below. That gets, that gets said in Minecraft. Let's just go to okay. the zoo. Let's just go to the <laughs> zoo, yeah. It doesn't it doesn't have actually any pens or anything like that. But yeah, so if people want to like go in the teleport. So Ring in the zoo. I have no idea where you guys are. <laughs> oh, there you are. Go back to the teleport. Oh, all right, yeah. we use this thing. Uh -huh. Yeah. Good Beam luck, up. Bye, X. <laughs> oh Sorry, my goodness! Oh, I'm gonna ride the I'm gonna ride the giraffe thing. I'm gonna run. <laughs> if, if only, if it, only you can make me. Oh wow! Oh, wow, that is. <laughs> That's nuts. I didn't get <laughs> that is insane. in the zoo, but Jeez. it's staying there. Meant, when you said animals, I was thinking like Minecraft animals, not. How giraffe. many hours? Jeez. <laughs> Oh, it took maybe and uh, maybe a couple. Yeah, well, you do right. it all in you your know. stream, don't you? Just do chisel yeah, bits. Yeah, yeah, I just sit there, just chisel bits. Yeah. So yeah, I've got like the zoo entrance. I've got again like those little details, so, like a beehive and ticker offices and stuff. You know what I love most about this, Falsy? You have little access animals. to like thousands of blocks using chisel. You have access to <laughs> making your own blocks with chisel and bits, and you just yeah. use the good old vanilla. I just use brick. vanilla. Because I don't have access to the other ones. I just go this with is, what I've got. This is amazing, this shop. I love the t-shirt store bit. I, lo I love the Burger Shack. Look at this place. Look, look at the, the cash registers. Yeah, look at this. It makes me want to eat burgers at Tropical Burgers. <clears throat> um, yeah, th this is this is where we should have sold them. them. Yeah, this is where we yeah. should have sold this them. This is like next level Minecraft. Chisel bits, isn't it? Yeah, this is next yeah, level sure. chisel bits, man. It's I could have supplied Ooh, the burgers here. Ooh, I want to pick up some t-shirt. I want the one with the, the carrot <laughs> on it. Yeah, I couldn't think of what to put on them. They're kind of a bit random, aren't they? <laughs> Yum. <laughs> the poster. <laughs> oh, that's when I was like, you know what I'll do? I'll try and make a custom painting. Yeah, it didn't go very well. <laughs> great. I like the but, it, but it is animated, so you know. Yeah. <laughs> Yum. <laughs> oh, yeah, I see. Yeah, oh, the, so the paintings cool. don't quite work otherwise. Oh, you've made little pandas and a giant freaking walrus. Oh, look <laughs> yeah. at the penguins, though. <laughs> look at the walrus. Look at them. <laughs> He's so doop face. Oh, <laughs> I remember <laughs> the walrus, Ren, from, from Project Also. Uh, yep, yep. <laughs> this, is, this is the walrus right here. Oh, that's awesome. Let's step on his head. I'm glad you could tell what it was, at least. But I'll take that. I'll take that. <laughs> oh, there's some living animals over here. I, I thought this horse was chiseling. <laughs> there are. There are some, yeah, there are some horses. <laughs> but yeah, I didn't get very far. I didn't, I didn't make any pens or anything. But but hey, I can I can do better next time. So we can go further. With it. Well, I mean, I got to say, guys, as the last four people on the server, like every single base completely unique from each other all doing really different things and that's the awesome thing about modern right it like mm -hmm. brings out your that's personality Minecraft man in general it's man awesome. yeah mm -hmm. just, Open just with oh, modded you can go a little further i didn't even see the ducks <laughs> yeah <laughs> they're oh, they're not swans. ducks they're swans oh they're ducks over no, here the, oh, ducks ducks. Ducks. oh yeah that is oh, awesome. awesome and the flamingo I think, I think i'm gonna make a thumbnail here oh <sighs> I think I think this is gonna be my thumbnail. It's gonna get out of the thumbnail, jeez. He killed the poor duck. Oh. <laughs> He's taking it with him. He's gonna put it on his, in his scallion pool. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It is, I need a duck in my scallion pool. <laughs> oh no, poor thing. Did he steal your duck? Oh my goodness, what a thief! He needs to put a block underneath it. <laughs> How rude. There you go. But this um, is amazing. yeah, jeez, guys. I I gotta say, wow. 
I'll yeah, say it was really say that's awesome. Pretty yeah. much it for, for my thing. And the world download is now available for people to come on and play mm -hmm. and perhaps perhaps take inspiration from what they've seen already, continue projects, start their own. They can do whatever they want with it now. Yep, if you guys yeah. want to finish my base. Um... <clears throat> and tweet it to us if you, if you extend them. <laughs> tweet yeah. it oh, to yeah, us. Oh, yeah, yeah, we'd love to see that stuff, yeah. Of course. Well, peeps, it's been a really great base tour, hasn't it? Yeah, yeah, and... it's been awesome. This I'm actually is, super is... inspired now. I want to play. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> I know. <laughs> oh, but that's that's it from us, I guess, then. And uh, that's it for this series of Hermit Pack. There'll be more modded things happening in the future, that's for sure. Thank yeah, you all for watching. Enough of it, man. Yeah. And, um, well, uh... Yeah, thank you. We don't want to end it, do we? <laughs> oh, we <laughs> don't. Just dragging out the end now. <laughs> Just dragging okay. it out. Bye, cruel world. I'm going to say that's it from us, man. The Hermit Pack series has been amazing. Thank you, everyone, for your support. GG. We'll see you soon in the future of more Hermitcraft adventures. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Bye.